Oi, mate. Oh, you want more? Hmm, yes. That Windows notification sound. <laughs> Yes. <laughs> what am I? What the fuck am I doing? Dexter, the one with the lab. The Dexter. Omelette to fromage. Hello. Hello, lads. Omelette to fromage. <laughs> oh, dear God. <laughs> Stiff as a rock. Nice! Hang on, hang on. Ta da! Art! Hey, favor. Give her a name. <laughs> What's her name gonna be? Give her a name. Namae. Wa nani? Name this very capable driver, pilot. <coughs> Sorry. I was about to start later, but I ended up having. Hello. Is this still little nightmares? Oh shit! <laughs> <coughs> Sorry about that. Mira! Alright, first come first, up. Mira it is. Uh, racing uh, pilot. T -t -t -t. Hello. Nice dice. Welcome to my little small collection of what I call my friends. <laughs> Hi. <clears throat> so, this is by virtue of being first. Uh, Mike's got the first dibs her name is Mira Mira is 
Russian for dream. Hi, thank you. Thanks for stopping by. <coughs> Sorry about that. As I was saying, I was uh, before I uh, was gonna start the stream. I was gonna have a shit. However, that's inappropriate. And artists never poop. Fact. <laughs> Alright, uh, let me just adjust some things. Then we'll get going once more. Need a glass of water. Alright, so first on the agenda. Uh, fix this. Oh. Yeah, uh, sorry about that again. I need to fix this leg, this leg, this hand, this foot before I start doing a bunch of stuff. So let's chill down a minute. Uh, slow down the music, get to the groove. Alright, my favorite music. There you go. Alright. Let's get to it. Uh-huh. There's a bit of a, pro a pro problem. There's a problem. My uh, tablet is a bit lagging. For some reason, it shouldn't be a problem. Uh, we're gonna do adjustments for now. The leg looks a bit stiff, to be honest. So we're gonna do adjustments focusing on the leg first, then the hand, and then... Uh, color it. I've found this artist on Instagram named uh, Vinny. That does a uh, wonderful art. Just does wonderful art. Uh, and I kind of want to get the inspiration uh, of his, of their art, especially the coloring. So I want to do that maybe soon. I don't know. Oh yeah, so. Uh, games. Okay. <laughs> While we're still here, I want to talk about something, uh, something different, something special. So, games, right? Video games. Uh, excuse me, get him with the mic. Uh, you have uh, retro games, you have modern games. Which one would people prefer? Which one would, you know, the likes of y'all would like to watch? Retro or modern games? Uh, when I say retro though, it won't be your typical retro. It will be racing games. So there's, if anyone may have played it, a little old game called Need for Speed Underground 2 that I actually bought. <laughs> as long as I enjoy, gotcha. Well, tomorrow, immediately straight tomorrow, uh, I'm planning on playing a retro racing game that people may have played, Need for Speed Underground 2. So that's about it. <laughs> uh, man. I was overhyped today. I was overhyped about streaming. But I actually don't know what to do once I started... Oh, I mean, I know what to do. I don't know what to talk about once I started streaming. So I just started talking about nonsense. <laughs> ay, 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 as you would. Man. Kaya sa Pilipinas. Oh yeah, the car. This car is a Nissan GTR GT3. 
I'll uh, bring up a uh, reference. So, a lot of people don't know much about cars and racing, right? Uh, it's alright. I don't want to alienate people. So, I want to introduce them slowly to what my interest is. Uh, which is uh, race cars, right? It's a bit of an alien concept to people. And uh, I get it. Not many do understand the why or the appeal in general, but this is the car. It's a Nissan GTR GT3 Nismo. That's the car on its side view. That's pretty much it. Uh, this car is a actual race car used in competition, Grand Touring. Uh, it's m designed to be within a set of rules. So, if you don't know, racing, professional racing, they have rules. So, there's a class system. You know how in high school you have sections and you have your class? The same applies to race cars. There are uh, classes within the uh, uh, series. So let's say you have this series that runs the GT3 class. And uh, on the GT3 class, uh, there are a set of rules that all cars follow uh, to ensure that it's fair racing. Uh, if you're, infam if you're like, familiar with the basic concept of racing, like maybe you've seen it from Tom and Jerry and such, uh, it may uh, look like uh, racing is just uh, building the fastest car or whatever, but no. There's actual rules that every car must follow and regulation in order to peep, uh, have the cars race safely and uh, fairly. No advantages, no unfair advantages. We'll continue. As for the color of Mira, Uh, I have an idea of making it uh, something aligns with red, maybe. I don't know yet. Mm -hmm. The car is red. The car that I use as a base is red. So maybe, man, my uh, CPU is taking so much. Uh, my mouse, my mouse, my pen tablet is actually lagging. Yeah, Jesus Christ. No matter. Uh, another thing, there's this uh, artist, yeah, I forgot to show, uh, on Instagram, Vinny Art, Vinne, V-I-N-N-E, amazing art, amazing colors, uh, here, they make art that is kind of similar in vain, that has a, uh, you know, uh, the, uh, well, they draw bikes, it's very... I can't I can't explain but I like their art Excuse me All right Leg is a bit done. You can uh, manage. Uh, next is. It's not as stiff as before. This one. Casually using the selection tool.
Okay. I guess that's just the nature of it. Art, I mean. You make a lot of mistakes, and then you, uh... Uh... Remedy those mistakes. Luckily, I had uh, much time in between the streams that I decided that I decided that I had uh, the opportunity to look back on what was wrong and uh, re refix, <laughs> redo the parts that needs to be redone. Now another thing is the hands. Pinky closer, please. There she goes. Yeah, we can probably move middle finger closer to man. There's another. There's a new VTuber, a friend of mine, gotta be debuting uh, Friday from where I'm from. Uh, really cool. Maybe I shouldn't move the... Yeah. <laughs> nah, bro. So there's this uh, motorsport fun pack. Is it? Okay, which part? I guess take a look. <laughs> Not good. Should be all right. Yeah. 
you know, I do want to add more things, right, of what makes the... Uh, I don't know. This seems a bit lacking in detail. I want to add something in here. Nah. I don't know. Some mecha themed something. <sighs> right? The uh, good as time as any to look at references. Athletes wear. There was something on the wrist, but what else? Man, I wish I was this good of an artist. The reference that I'm looking at. Pilots d won't usually wear much, right? I have an idea. My tablet is lagging quite some bit. No idea why. Oh yeah, there's such thing as a Hans device in real life. Uh, head and neck support. We should make a version of that here.
There you go. Now, there are some... I need to do something about the framing. You see, while this does work... Uh, I need to bring the subject uh, out more. Do that. I think we're just gonna shrink the canvas. Hmm. Let's uh, look at other ways. Yeah, let's just shrink the canvas. I don't think there's a much height. Um. I I, sh I usually work on a smaller. Uh, canvas. There you go. Hang on. Before we do that, oopsie. The precious tire tech. There we go. This is much better framed. I think I'd say so myself. Now let's move on with the act actual coloring. No. Select the bits that you aren't gonna... You know what? I'll, I'll do it by hand. Color palette. Color palette. Let's think of the color palette. Uh, this tutorial is gonna be red. This type of red that kind of red right red that's a bit too dark this red is fine this red this is gonna be uh think of a palette Black. This is going to be the blackest black. Very red uh, theme. We can uh, counteract that with a bit of blue. Yeah, 
Yeah, that looks nice. Uh, I wish it was more a richer type of room. Yeah, yeah, that's cool. It's gonna be this. I'm not confident about this. How about just the yellow? That could work too. Pink also. Let's not make this brown. This kind of yellow. Yeah, alright, that's a color palette. There you go. I have no study prior on what a good color palette should be. So that's just a bit of a trial for now. Oh yeah, I, I like this blue already. Now we make the skin. Hmm. The skin. Oh yeah, oh yeah. What are you doing here? Yeah, I want to put some tattoos on Mira. Mira's a great name. And I'm gonna put Mira on her. What's the Russian, the fake Russian? Fake Cyrillic? And I'm gonna do a fake Russian of the word Mira. Once my energy is calm. <laughs> Ay, 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 ay. This is a very inefficient way to do this, to color something. Yeah, yeah, yeah. There's a certain style, okay? So it's a bit weird, a weird uh, goal of mine, but I wanted to do something with a certain style, not just a certain like I, I want to copy this art style, but a certain emotion because uh, specific art styles breed out specific emotions, and there's a specific emotion that I want to bring out, a melancholic yet adventurous type of feeling. I want to make something. That says exactly that. Melancholic and adventurous. That's my uh, journey. <laughs> Art journey so far. What I'm trying to create. Something serious yet. Uh, wild, if you know what I mean. I wanna uh, think creatively. I have. Some parts inspired by that artist. The colors, they're a bit inspired, but I wanna especially do my own twist to it. Hang on, let me bring it up. Here we go. <laughs> this type of art. You've seen this before, I'm sure. Uh, Vinny, V I N N E, artist. There. So, yeah. I'm not saying I'd like to uh, copy that art. But that, at that emotion, that atmosphere, melancholic yet cutesy, I wanna bring that to the table. With my own uh, style of art, of course. 
my uh, there are a bunch of uh, artists that I idolize and every one of them I try to make something an art of mine as close to theirs as, not as close but let their design influence my own as much as possible without diluting my own uh, style and uh, I do recognize my own very much from others so at least that's one good uh, part of it now let us color the clouds thank you color palette very good there is a way to do these the color very efficiently and that is by oh yeah i've noticed that uh, your blacks shouldn't be really black like you shouldn't use full black when you're doing black i guess if you want a really serious art but if you want to make uh but like for the style that i want to see here's the thing i think i do very good with my light Oftentimes, when I post my whip, my work in progress, and my finished art, the work in pro progress does better. And uh, I think there's a charm to the lines, the line quality. And I wanna try and emphasize that more rather than the colors. But I also wanna, you know, balance out the colors and the lines. If I put too much detail in the color and shading, it just blocks out the lines. And uh, that's a problem. So... We'll see. There's a Discord server, by the way. Of uh, Filipino VTubers, PH VTubers, Pornhub <laughs> VTubers, that uh, <laughs> Pornhub here, that uh, I just joined and uh, hopefully to make some friends. Hopefully, twenty-three. Uh, hello, Kyoshi. Domo, hello, welcome. So there are a lot of things that I keep in mind for now. Uh, one, coloring. I've uh, spoken to my friend, and she told me, well, my friend, my girlfriend, and she told me that my art has gotten very good recently, ever since I started streaming, uh, especially the uh, anatomy, the proportion. And that's my goal. I uh, I intended to practice those first, but now I want to focus on more creative stuff like uh, coloring. <clears throat> Sorry, I realized that realistic colors doesn't make it better. And uh, the reason why I started, why I deviated from the realistic art style in the first place, is that I don't want to make reality. I want to be creative with my universe that I'm creating, right? With art. And I think that's what artists should do, right? Uh, uh, right, Yoshi? <laughs> like, you should uh, explore and uh, be more creative with what you should do. So, I started uh, trying to... Uh, maybe... Well, not. I haven't started yet. I just started now. To maybe try and deviate my coloring from realistic ones. Maybe have a, not a black... Uh, uh, shade for shade and all that stuff kind of like Venus art the one I found however I still don't want to deviate from the deep shadows that I've got going on so I'm really trying to balance this these styles in my head and I really want to make it work so that's the goal for now yeah yeah, yeah. now that's my lieutenant <laughs> You do want to balance, that is true. A uh, balance, I mean you do want to get creative. 
and uh, I feel like by restricting myself to realistic lighting and realistic environments, I'm kind of restricting my creative freedom a bit. Whereas I should be making a world where reality could technically be my own, as Thanos said, right? So I think I'm gonna focus it now, focus on doing that now. But I do know that I still don't want to deviate too far from uh, the reality that I want to see. The shadows that I already mentioned. We can put the characters in a, in, in a void or adjust their col color palette to make them more appealing to look at. But I don't want to twist and bend reality. Whew. That's been my goal. I, I want to make the art that I want to make before I go back to school, to medicine school, which is very near. Oh yeah, by the way, uh, spoilers, I might have a collab going on. I'm not sure yet. <laughs> so, uh, yes, I might. Collabs are fun. Uh, I wonder what collab though. There, so yeah, I mentioned I joined a group of uh, Filipino VTubers. So I want to get a collab going. It's really hard because I don't want to uh, ask for a collab immediately. I want to actually be their friends <laughs> like i want to build friendship first and i want to interact with them be their friends so that when we collab eventually probably i don't know they'll be friends you know oh fun fact uh so philippines right philippines weren't Exa exactly a country known for its motorsport heritage we almost had none it's a poor country uh, people like to spend money elsewhere I get it it's a bit sad on my part but I get it I understand however we do uh, have a, a racing color a national racing color which is red and blue I don't wanna, you know, uh, do that here yet, but it's a, uh, it's a, it's a thought. <laughs> yeah, yeah, build a connection first, so they won't know. <laughs> but yeah, I mean, my intention wasn't just to uh, collab. It's really to build a friendship. And then I think uh, collaboration, collabing, would be the sign that I succeeded in making friends. So that's kind of the landmark, like the grading. The, the landmark, yeah, the landmark that says that I made friends would be the collab. But I do have my existing uh, friends, thanks to being uh, VTubers, which... Mm, may spawn a collab I don't know no promise yet although I'm not gonna lie I do wish I get a collab with in a racing game an actual need for speed or GTA 5 oh no this shouldn't be white how about a double two-tone white and white and dark Oh yeah, is the audio good? I hope it's good. Uh, okay. Let's talk about something else. Uh, art. <laughs> Let's talk about art, right? So, uh... Uh... 
Have you ever just had a moment where you're very confident about your own art only to see it crash and burn in front of you? <laughs> Oddly specific. Uh, back in high school, I think I had like, uh, we were supposed to do something, a class where art is needed. Oh no, no, this wasn't high school, this was in college. So I volunteered, hey, this is my idea, it's gonna be really cool, there's gonna be hot air balloons and the board and whatnot. Cool, right? Uh, no, my idea was just too complex, it's too small, because it's painting. I did uh, I failed to realize that making a uh, like a bulletin board ish thing I relied too much on paint that I failed to do everything else whoop de do and from then on I stayed far away from bulletin boards <laughs> not really another thing is uh, poster making so uh, I had uh, joined these poster making competitions uh, fun but I'm never really good at making those sort of posters. I'm more of making illustrating characters, as you have uh, seen. So, uh, whoop to do, crash and burn. Out of uh, I, I don't think I got last place, but I got certainly wasn't a poster. Actually, now that I think about it, it's probably the most clever poster I've, uh, the people have ever seen. But it's not their definition of a poster. Uh, but that's life. The honestly, my art style w isn't that sought after by the public. Normies don't want no anime, and I get that. I understand. I, I, I'm not saying about my art style. Maybe it's just my art style, I don't know. <laughs> I, I get jealous a lot of people and then uh, with their commissions. You see, I don't, I'm not good at making friends. I'm not good at making internet friends especially. So I, I really don't have much of a connection except for my very few friends that I'm very proud to call my friends. Thank you very much. Y'all are my friends, don't you worry. Yush. Alright. Uh, Alright. Roll call. Everyone say hi, and those who said hi, I will put the name on the art. I will do this again in a later time. Because, I, I don't know. Just want you see racing right race cars there are a lot of sponsors in a race car but you really don't know hello uh what country has the blue and red and blue as natural racing color the philippines i don't know if this is true because i've certainly done my research and i found nothing but on wikipedia but it said there that the national racing color for the philippines is a red chassis with a blue bonnet a blue hood I don't know if that's true, but since there are no other country with that color and there are no uh, uh, nothing to say otherwise, I will believe it as fact and no one can stop me because the idea of a national racing color is frankly stupid. Okay, Kyoshi and Rorudo, I will put you in this art. But where? <laughs> I'll make a roll call again later. Uh, you'll be in the legs. <laughs> you'll sponsor the legs. Nice. Maybe. But I don't like to think it's just red because, you know, Ferrari has it. Italy has it. 
I don't think it's relevant anyway because the Philippines never raced in the international scene much. So that's not relevant. It's kind of like a throwaway fact. You'll be banned. You need to be banned, Kyoshi. Cool, red. Still. Uh, it kind of clashes with Italy. Italy's color is red. Rosa Corsa, red. The same color Ferrari uses. Uh, Kyoshi's spelling will be a bit different. Then Ruda would be in the other leg. Uh, let's change the position. Uh, you'll be... No. Yellow? No, white. Still white. I wonder what kind of red though. Is it still Rosa Corsa red? Leg sponsors. Uh, how do you type it? Ru. Okay, Ru. Ru. No. And then the continuation of the name. It's like a leg band. Ain't that nice. Like a delinquent. Oh cool, dark red. Blood red. Oh, is it inverted? Oh, it's inverted. Doesn't matter. <laughs> Jesus Christ. It had to be inverted. <sighs> Mataku. Blue is a uh, France. French racing blue. Rosa Corsa literally just means red racing or racing red. I don't think it's. Oh yeah, is it is Ro is Rosa Corsa the same as the burgundy that Alfa Romeo uses though? Yeah, Alfa Romeo uses burgundy. And then Alfa Romeo, uh, Alfa, fun fact about the Ferrari history, Alfa Romeo had a racing team, uh, a Formula 1 racing team, uh, headed by Ferrari, known as Scuderia Ferrari. And then Ferrari just separated, became its own brand, and beat Alfa Romeo once again. So that's why Ferrari was burgundy in the beginning. Alright, right. How do I fit this orange though? Uh, how about we two tone it? Yeah, 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 we two tone, we two tone. Good idea. Uh, red and yellow just looks like McDonald's. Right? It just looks like McDonald's. Uh, I'd like to keep doing a yellow-ish look though, maybe not this bright yellow.
Red Racing? Okay. That's some news. Is it the burgundy one? The burgundy color. Did they use the is the Rosa Corsa the burgundy color? Honda has its own red color that's actually very cool too. Milano red present at the Mugen RR Civic. Japan has the simplest racing colors, literally just their flag. French racing blue indeed. I'm not sure if this color will stick. Not really that good of a color, to be honest. Yeah, that does not look good, does it? What about white? White's a bit better. I have an idea. There we go. Shoe time. Uh, what do we do? We color the shoes blue. So it just jumps out a different color. <laughs> we can color this blue. I don't think there's anything else. We'll see. I don't think it'll stick. Then some white. <laughs> this looks a bit off, not gonna lie. But that is cool. Maybe this yellow fits. Yeah, maybe this works. Is that alright? Golden blue and then matched with the... Alright, I'll, I'll, I'll finish off some bits. See if it still works. Very Pinoy. Man, colors. I still don't think I've gotten the hang of it. <sighs> if it's a bit more faded, maybe it'll look good? Nah, it just blends in too much with the ground. Alright, let's remove the colors. It's very racing though. It's very athletic. How about if we make it a little purple, see? A little indigo, see? Oh yeah, that works. That feels much better. Does this, does this color work when it's applied to the glove though? So the pilot is basically blue feet, <laughs> blue feet and blue hands. And they're red everywhere. What's white and black and red all over? Oh yeah, oh yeah.
Oh ya, oh ya. Does this fit the colors? Hmm. Really doubt it. There has to be some other things you can turn blue. Turn this blue. No, it's not blue. This blue. Uh, let's see. Let's see what happens. We could gradient it. White. White's much better. Hair time. Let's see let's use a dark hair this time. Are the lines still seen? Or a white white hair would be nice. Your hair is white. Thank you for your cooperation. I hope I do. It looks. I hope it looks alright. I wonder what shade of red this is. Matches this green. Christmas. Yeah, I, I have a bunch of other games I want to uh, try doing. Uh, racing games especially old ones like uh, PlayStation 2 ones my childhood basically uh, we have Gran Turismo 4 we have uh, Burnout anyone know Burnout Burnout 3 especially Burnout 3 Takedown possibly the greatest uh, arcade game ever made uh, we have uh, Tokyo, uh, we have Kaido Battle, as it's known. Uh, we have this little known game called Ridge Racer. I'm actually gonna play the spin-off, R Racing Evolution, which is based on Ridge Racer. So this R Racer Revolution is actually kind of like Ace Combat but with cars and racing not street racing like Fast and Furious like actual track racing it looks really interesting it looks really interesting I say that I played it when I was a kid uh, I played it badly but I still played it it's pretty fun so I wanna play those on stream uh, I don't know what the plan is does that red really match? Let's color the car. I don't want to go too far. Uh, let's match the color and everything. I don't want to put too much detail on the car this time. I think that's a bit of a problem I had before, but I put too much detail on things that don't need to be put to be detailed. So the focus kind of went away from the subject to the car, which is the only the secondary focus. Can I bucket this? No. Nope. Can I bucket this? Hell no. <laughs> floating girl floating hair of a girl. 
So yeah, I wanna carve my own identity, yet I wanna do some more art. Speaking of motorsport, Formula One, right? Uh, Formula One is the most popular social media sport out there. <laughs> social media sport, a sport on social media. And my god, has this season been amazing? The 2021 season has been really amazing. Uh, as uh, the kids would like to call, a banger. Uh, maybe because uh, the, the champion isn't winning. <laughs> uh, we all love to see an underdog uh, win. And that's what's currently happening in Formula 1. And people are loving it. And who wouldn't? Uh, a young uh, driver, Max Verstappen, with the age of 23 years old, is uh, really uh, giving uh, the champion, Lewis Hamilton, a run for his money. It's very... They have a very convincing lead in the championship right now. They've won the past three races for against uh, Mercedes uh, Lewis Hamilton Red Bull uh, won three or four against Mercedes it's not weird to hear Red Bull uh, energy drink winning races against Mercedes Benz a car manufacturer <laughs> but guess what that's exactly what's happening And it's pretty damn cool. They're gonna be all dark. I'm not gonna follow the set of course uh, standard this time. Let's see if it looks alright still. Yeah, I'm definitely going to be putting a gradient. I want to try and finishing this art right now. No more dilly-dallying and the uh, uh delays well i want to try i don't think i'm i'm gonna be able to blue steering wheel i like to have a nice uh, different steering wheel on my car in real life a different colored one yeah this probably won't be seen in a way What does it look like? Okay. I guess there are some details that need to be lifted off. What is this? 
Oh, that's part of the dash. Will this layering work? Maybe. Gotta be white though. The roll cages. Blindingly white. Yep, that's the roll cage. This all right though. want it to be a bit more subtle subtly I'm bringing back the gradient so we'll see what it looks like I hope people aren't really watching my streams and not do anything else, right? I'm sure you'll you'll be just listening in the background and maybe checking mo occasionally, right? Because <laughs> that's probably the normal thing to do. But if you're like watching it with 100% attention, that's that's mighty impressive, might I add. And I uh, recognize that talent and wish to congratulate you <laughs> talent Wh which part is yes <laughs> Yes, 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 yes. No, no, no. That's a daily JoJo reference. <laughs> See? GTR If you ever look search for videos, if you ever just curious about a specific car, just search on it on YouTube and you'll see exactly what you're looking for.
as of the life of a car. You know what? Okay. Quick rant. I'm gonna make a big rant, alright? The car culture sucks in the Philippines. Yeah, you heard me? Filipinos? Yeah. Car culture is cringe. Right? Half the time, it's less about cars and more about how to impress girls. What are you, 12? It's literally taking away being a car enthusiast, is, which is about the cars, and putting more into what it's not, which is impressing. Yeah, sure, you can make it to impress people, alright? It's not just impressing girls, it's impressing girls uh, enough to bed them. It's just cringy frat boys. Car enthusiasts in the Philippines are just cringy frat boys. They're all about style with no substance. That's why I'm making car race cars. Because they're the essence of the opposite of uh, the Filipino car culture. Uh, they're functional. They do something. They do impressive things. Not just for show. Question is, did I do enough? Is that alright? <sighs> alright. My rant is over. I am still bugged about colors color choices hang on Woo. I feel like I've done red before what if I change this clothes an orange one Yeah, it's really fit. White and red. You know what? I think this works well with this one. Or this one. Maybe oh my God. I am also half asleep. <laughs> Let me finish coloring the car and that will shade the body. Subvert your expectations. I wonder what's going on in that uh, Discord server. They're not yet political in there. That doesn't look right. Oh, but it does. Maybe white isn't an appropriate color. Ugh, my fan is chirping like a mouse. Raise. Oh, 
Oh no, my fan is noisy. If my fan is dying. My wall fan. <laughs> Amazing. All right, let me just do this one tire text and then we'll get back to the person, the subject. There's a lot of things to do here. I wonder what I'll be playing tomorrow. I kinda wanna take a break and not stream. But I kinda do wanna play video games. You know what? I'll go play Need for Speed Underground 2 tomorrow. Uh, let's see how it holds up. The modern time. And uh, see how we go. I think that looks really cool. Okay, let's bring out a gradient. Let's go shading. Skin. The sunlight is gonna be this direction. My idea is sun is gonna go from go to. Uh, here uh, behind the GTR kind of like this so there would be shadow casted on here and here there's gonna be shadow so and then uh, after that there's gonna be another edge lighting in this direction right here so just edge lighting here edge or maybe something below here edge lighting maybe pink or maybe something and maybe a little bit more edge lighting here right so we'll put those in And then here. All right, let's get to it. Arrows, you stay. Also, I'm trying to look for a different uh, software to do art. I've heard of Eclipse Studio Paint. Is that good? I'm very used to Sai. Sai has been my program of choice for well over 8 years. So I don't know how well I do when I transition to other programs. Skin? Maybe put a bit of edge rather than uh, solid.
reduce the opacity and there you have kinda <laughs> it's too detailed to see Um, there you go. Sort of one part of the lighting. Uh, let's uh, blur some bit. Not too blurry. Abs, baby. And then, uh, subsurface scattering, the fancy term for pinky edges. very slightly pinky edges all the layers that I want to do. Uh, let's clean up the lines. Alrighty, alright, alright. Getting in trouble now. Uh, do you know this anime called Talentless Nana? Yeah, that anime. Uh, there's a. It's free on YouTube, I think, yeah. I really don't like it. <laughs> The whole deception thing and the whole ma the main character is a villain. Uh, I don't like it. Maybe if I kept uh, watching, I understand the character better. I just don't like it from the beginning. Whoop de doo. It's about it's a weird concept, but the main character is kind of the villain. Imagine Among Us the anime, but the main character is a really good player and you're not rooting for her that's how I describe it Um. 
Alright. Oh, we missed something. Can't believe I didn't see that. Silver. Ish. Ear pieces. Just because. There's no real need for this. This looks cool for me. That's a bit of a pain. Being underneath the hair and all. There you go. Clothes. Man. It's tricky. Better move the arrow. It's not as uh, distracting. Uh huh. I want to show. Proper definition on these. Oh yeah, we're supposed to write like Mira beside her uh, as a tattoo. Uh, I don't know. We can just skip that probably. Oh, there are the gaps. What else? What? What else am, are we missing here? Oh yeah, we're supposed to make it her like right uh, look like she just went on a marathon. So, uh. We're gonna make it look sweaty. How are we gonna do that? Sweats McGee. Reference this again. Okay, I think I know how. Sweaty McGee. I hope this works. I really don't know what I'm doing. The white. Right? Yeah. Alright, and then we're gonna make her face flush.
Okay. Make it flush like that was just the hardest workout you've ever experienced. Let's add a little. Yeah, for no reason at all. Makes it look cool, I guess. Clothes time. Radiant. Yeah, I'd like orange, please. Orange, please. Yeah, see, that looks nice. And blue on the bottom. Maybe even this sort of black. Let's see. Oh yeah! Tanya, Saga of Tanya the Evil. Anyone heard of that? It's an infamous anime about uh, imperialism. Kinda like, it's supposed to be about bad, that imperialism is bad. By the way, it's a good show. I like it. The ideas presented are interesting. If I say so myself. Part that is not red. Because we only apply the gradient to red. Yep, this looks good. Oh, wrong, wrong, wrong. It just looks like this is dirty. <laughs> yeah, we're not. This is better on its own. Uh, we still gonna remove this. Then replace this with a color. Color like yellow. That looks pretty alright. Hmm, maybe not that black. The yellow is pretty good. What if I put blue? <laughs> Is it gradient overload? Yeah, it's a bit overloaded. 
Tone down the yellow. There you go. Sorry about that. Rogue. Uh, nope. Initial D, right? Is it a realistic anime? Or, in terms of anime, how does it compare? How is this realism? Surprising, it's actually pretty good. A lot of things uh, in Initial D have been consulted with a racing driver with actual experts on the field, and it's really good. There are a lot of things in Initial D that's, uh, that's really good. <laughs> I don't know what to say. to show this? Is this some sort of fetish? Jesus. Hope not. I think I made a pretty good- she's supposed to be an athlete. Like a pilot athlete. I think I made a pretty good uh, impression of uh, an athlete here. Gone to the shading part yet. How do I portray sweatness? Sweatness? Sweat. And uh, maybe I won't portray, I can't portray, that's the thing. Let's see. Uh, well, I'll just have to shade the clothes. Neck break. Uh, neck break. I guess. 
Ah, felt nice. Hmm, the lighting, the lighting. Would be less, less pronounced. Let's see, uh, shade. Yeah, if I just color that dark. I just colored this whole thing dark. seems all right it's pretty good uh put shading in here oh yeah i should ready the i should use the eraser tool So we can do the shading much, much better. Woo! Tomorrow, what am I gonna do tomorrow? Man, streaming is just so fun. <laughs> Even though you have very little audience, it's still very fun. I'm doing it the right lighting, right? Still the right way, right? Hopefully. <sighs> Man, how long has it's only been Tuesday? Jesus Christ! Is it Tuesday or is it Wednesday? What day is it? My God! It's Tuesday, right? It's Wednesday. It's Wednesday, my dudes. Only Wednesday, and my god, has the week been so long. Is white hair a good idea? No, I don't think so. We'll change the hair. Black hair? Black is actually kind of cool. I don't want to settle with black though. Yellow hair. Blonde Red hair Everything is red Maybe this type of black suits it Let's see, Filipino, yeah? Maybe this suits it Or maybe the same kind of blue Or something completely different maybe Orange 
Orange is pretty cool. Black though. Maybe blue. Maybe purple. Green. Some different. Different, all right. About the same colors. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That looks nice. Okay. Then I think we'll do. All right. Uh, hold on. Hold on. Let me do something. can put yellow. Hold on. This is what I was talking about earlier. Edge lighting. Mm. See if it works. Edge lighting? Man, hard to tell. Although that is pretty cool, how about we use a... We point the other one yellow. A fiery lighting. really kind of cool though not gonna lie that looks pretty cool then we use red for the other side Okay, okay. Or maybe blue. Or we use the other side as blue. Yeah, that's nice. That could work. Or some of it is blue. I don't know. Mm. 
interesting set of conundrums. Whatever. I'm too tired for this. <laughs> I say that, but I'm really not. I'm not tired for this. I'm tired for every where everything else in my life. That looks really good. Hair. Oh wait, no, not there yet. Um, blue. And yellow. Some red too, I wonder. Yeah, red kind of- no, blue. Blue works better. Hair time gonna be tricky because although I did put a lot of detail to the hair as is already I don't think uh, I should put much more details there you go Yoshi Yoshi Hello Yellow Pitch lighting on the bottom As stated earlier And another edge lighting Here And the result is a mess. All right, we're not gonna do that. Let's just gradient it. Gosh, just a bit like that and then put on the luminous glint of the hair artists are amazing right like no, not me like actual artists they're just how <laughs> how can you even think of that you know have you ever found have you ever found yourself reacting that way to an artist? It's like, Jesus Christ! I can't even do this! <laughs> yep. Me wishing I could do... All I could... Uh, all I, I w Me wishing I could do... The art done by my idols. I don't really know as I'm very not confident at even this one draw the eyes eyes yellow in Tagalog Blue. 
Oh, the yellow kind of like a bird. Blue. I won't sing again, I promise. People can draw unnaturally good looking eyes. I cannot. I can draw a normal eye. Huh. I haven't saved in a while. <laughs> oh no! Okay. He's sort of done. We can work on the car now. Not put in too much detail. How do I do this? How do I do this? This is a big problem. I do like the color. Scan. That's fine. Hair. The hair still feels a bit plasticky. Let's put three strands. There you go. Let's focus on the car. Shift lights. Oh no.
Shift light. And then blue. Uh, yellow, orangey. Yikes. There we go. Okay, there's so much more detail on the car. So just a carbon fiber texture. No, no, no. Can we just ignore all those? Right? How do I do this? How do I do this? I'm an idiot. Why did I draw the other side of the car? Then let's just put a much better. How do we do this? Uh, okay, decals. Let's start with the decals. I'm gonna save it first. We're gonna simplify the car. As best as we can. We focus on the important stuff. That's the plan. What color is this? I see, I see, I see. Now, gotta put on the stickers. Rather paint on the stickers. Oh boy, alright. Mm, let's say goodbye for the clothes and skin for now. Clothes will stay on. Motul. We'll match this red. We're not gonna stray from this red. Do we, do we just much better? And then white. Uh, let's see what it looks like. <laughs> you, you just barely see it. I gotta rely on this palette. Nope. Oh. Everything's gonna be just white. <laughs> like my pun there. 
It's not gonna be seen anyway. I drew so much into. Hi, 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 hi. Bridgestone. That's the tire brand. So what changed from my usual art style? I put in a gradient. Uh, I made the colors gradient instead of solid colors I uh, I used to do gradients back then I figured it was unnecessary now I brought him back for a bit more creative reasons I uh, put in the edge lighting and I tried to polish a bit of the art the color palette so hopefully it's much better now Philippine flag 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 uh, red's gonna stay on top. Blue, this shade of blue will go here. White here, and then yellow. Yoshi, Yoshi. I hope people will appreciate this. It's not the best of art, but I hope people still like it. Sorry. All right. Oh God, stretching my back. What's next? Okay. Uh -huh. Lighting and uh, shading for the curve. The GTR. I'm gonna simplify this for now. These are the tires, the rims, the wheels, and I'm gonna color them. It's a bit hard. I'm gonna eat, take a potato shit chip and eat it. chip and eat it sorry I keep making that reference I think this would be sufficient. This would be enough for now. The 
erase this erase this erase this Pretty good for now. Oh, yeah, this. Forgot about that. The direction of the lighting. Quite a bit. Okay. Amogus. Oops. Too much lighting. That's not good. This doesn't look good. Yeah, this doesn't look good. Uh, we can uh, centralize the brightness rather than being on the edge. That looks a lot better. Yeah, we're gonna put in another color. Oh yeah, I haven't put in a gradient yet. This is a lot, a bit confusing. I, I'm just, I'm just throwing too many colors into the air. But I'm doing very well. <laughs> Sorry if I'm not making any topics up. I really don't, kind of don't have the mood. <laughs> Hello. Uh, thank you very much. Welcome. I'm almost done. So. If you have the time, I wished for you to accompany me till the end, maybe? <clears throat> Perhaps. Uh, hello! Thank you very much! 
It's not every day I get random street uh, random people in my uh, uh uh viewership buttons steering wheel buttons uh a race car today is very much like a fighter plane a fighter jet no joke really it's very intricate a lot of things are always kept under uh the telemetry is called telemetry. Everything is uh un is monitored. And when I say everything, I mean literally er any everything, not just the tires or the uh brake temperatures, oil, fuel. Even when you brake, when you accelerate, your steering inputs, literally everything is monitored. So, I will try and not put too many details on our GTR. Uh, I fear it will get, it will take away the attention from the subject. So instead, we'll just put a good old gradient. orangey gradient from our red GTR let's see how it looks uh oh I've been streaming for about two and a half hours and I think we're almost there Almost. Almost. I'm always watching Wazowski. Always watching. No joke. She was always watching. Windows. Interesting concept to do. I uh, just do it with a bunch of glare. That's not really that good looking. But what if we make the glare colored? Just like this. Like this and like that. Alright. <laughs> We're almost done. Just a bit of smidge left. Now the final piece would be the... Shadows. That's correct. Shadows. Man, my neck is tired. Uh, let's put a few more details on the uh, vehicle, the GTR. A bit more detail to make it look like an actual metal beast. A metal goliath. Not, not a goliath. Although the GTR is a big boy. A metal uh, contraption built for speed and elegance.
Yikes. Let's not put one there. That should work. That should work. Talking as if it's a machine. That should uh, look good, right? Does it look alright? It looks alright? I hope it looks alright. My uh, wall fan is just being acting up. This looks alright, right? Doesn't look bad. I hope it doesn't. I really worked hard on the palette. I'm gonna look for a better, a uh, different uh, color palette next time. But this is really nice. From an, again, inspired from an artist named uh, Vinny, V Vine, V I N N E. Amazing art. Uh, the, his color, his or their color palette, really inspired this. So I'm not gonna take any uh, credit and say that's all my imagination. I really love that person's art. Uh, what layer is this? The pal- the... Samples. Oh no. Oh no. Is this you? There you are. Uh-huh. I'm gonna put shadows now. First is over the vehicle. Here. The floof of a hairstyle. Whoops. And then... How about we use this blue? How about we use this yellow? Nah, we'll use your, our normal... Shadow is that way, parallel to the ground here. Would be this direction. No, 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 that's not right. Shadow should be here. And it leans. No, 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 no. Sideways, forward. Is this <laughs> Am I shadow? Hang on, don't worry, don't worry. My shadow. <laughs> Jeez, 
Jesus. That's this one, and then this other shadow located here. I hope this is alright. I don't think it is. Shadows still don't look good. But let's focus on this. This jerk. Okay, what if the shadows are just... Is that right? Uh, no, 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 no. Mistakes happen. Just didn't wish it did happen this often. Alright, are we doing it? Are we are we actually making progress? Alright. Is that good? Is that looking alright? Orange. Nope. Oh, orange looks really nice. I don't want to copy Vinny's uh, style though. Vinny. How do you pronounce that? Oh, oh, oh. I have an idea. I have an idea. I'll keep this one in. And then we'll make another... Let's see, how does that work? We'll make another shadow? Does this work? I feel like it's not gonna work. Yeah, it's not working. <laughs> and then I'm thinking maybe a different... Shade on this one. Maybe just a gradient, a little gradient on the shadow be nice just like that and on this side get the yellow maybe I don't know I hope it looks all right Of course, we can't forget the shadow of the vehicle itself. Ah, 
Higher depth of field. Oh dear. Oh, <laughs> the program froze for a bit. There you go. And then the lighting on the shadow. And I think that's it. Wow. That's actually. How is it? How is this? Is this alright? Is this uh, so good? <laughs> I hope this is good. Let me try changing the background. Uh, maybe yellow. Whoops. Yeah, bl I've already established blue. I'll find maybe a different shade of blue, maybe. Oh, this is a nice, uh, a little greenish blue. This one's cool. Okay. So. Oh, is this? Um, uh, Mira. Her name is Mira, by the way. Uh, let's tattoo Mira on her skin. Uh, how, I don't know how to make it look like a tattoo, though. Uh, Mira, 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 skin. Tattoos. <laughs> oh, there's a bug on my phone. No, no, a literal bug, like a cockroach or something in my phone. Jesus Christ, scared me. Uh... Mira is dream. Now let's not make a tattoo of that. I don't know how tattoos work. I'm not a tattoo artist. Uh, you know what? Let's instead of a tattoo, let's put her. Let's put the word Mira on her jersey here. Hello. Oh, oh dear. Internet just cut off for a second. That sucks. Sorry, but thank you for the support. <sighs> That's a bit. Jesus Christ. But thank you. <laughs> I uh, I will finish this by blurring some of the bits, but it's pr practically done. So so thank you so much for coming along and joining me on this uh, quite confusing stream, might I add. But you've joined me nonetheless, and I can't thank you enough. Oh, I'm just blur this peacefully. <laughs> there you go. Put on a signature. Voila. We are done. <laughs> Unable to connect chat. Amazing.
Woo. And with that, thank you so much for coming along. I apologize, the stream was cut because of internet issues that I will punch somebody in the face. Maybe the internet provider tomorrow. Thank you all for coming. I hope to see you next time. Maybe I'll get to see this uh, art floating around the internet somewhere. Oh no, I forgot the palette. Oh, you, you palette, you. There you go. Thank you again. Have a nice evening slash morning, everyone. Bye-bye. Matane!